Good afternoon, sir. You are the last one in the conference room. Is everything okay? Oh, of course. It was an amazing conference. You are amazing too. I'm glad you liked it. I completely appreciate your very good comments for us. Yeah, you're welcome. Honestly, I also would like to express myself as you did here. Seriously, that's very good. Are you also a conferencist? No, no, but I work as a seller in an important company. I need to convince the customers. Oh, I see. Then I'm glad you came to this selling conference. Have you liked it? I was listening to you very carefully and also taking notes of everything you said. Awesome. Then is there anything else I can help you with? Just tell me. Oh, I'm glad you asked. Well, in the third point, you talked about convincing people. That's true. I mentioned the steps to convince any person. I did it slowly. Oh yeah, sure. But I didn't understand that part very well. Can you explain it? Of course. But I will do it shortly, because I don't have much time now. Oh, of course. I will listen to everything you have to say very carefully. Well, first... You need to ask the correct questions properly. That way you'll know the customer. Yeah, I took notes of that. But what happens if the customer doesn't want to answer? That's why you will ask him or her politely. And then you will say that you will help her or him. I get it now. If you tell the customer you will help them, it will be easier. That's correct, but you must do it carefully. Do not ask many questions. Sure, I know that very well. Once I asked too many questions and... See, I know that. And you don't need to do it fast. You have to take your time for this. Oh great, I will take notes of that too. And what happens after that? Then you have to explain them perfectly all the benefits of your product or service. But how can I do that? I mean, I can't express myself very well. I explain terribly. Alright then. You need to speak softly first. So you can sound more relaxed, you see? Oh, that's a good advice. Because I usually speak very fast and nobody understands me. Then you verbally explain why they have to buy your products and not your competitions. Fantastic. Then I finish with all the explanation and close the sale, right? No, not yet. You need to vastly explain all the benefits, all of them. Okay, so then I will tell them the price and quickly close the sale. And that's it. Wait. Do not mention the price until they ask you for it. That is something really important. Alright, and what happens if they are extremely difficult to convince? 
then you stop talking and give them some minutes. That's also important. Let them think. I normally try to push my potential customers to buy my products. That doesn't work. No, never do that. You need to wait for them to take the decision. Very patiently. Yeah, sometimes they need to consider the offer more time and think very well. You will just tell them that if they need any help or have any other question, they can contact you. Wow, it seems you have a lot of experience as a seller. You must sell thousands of dollars. Not precisely, but I normally sell good amounts of money every month. Where or how did you do to learn so many things about selling products and services, sir? Curiously, when I was a child, I used to sell candies to my partners. I loved selling. Wow, so you always liked to sell products then. That's how you acquired experience. Well, I had to. I poorly grew in a very precarious condition. It was difficult. I didn't know that. Unluckily, I grew up in a good economical condition, so... Oh, no, it is not necessary to be poor to learn how to sell. That's not correct. So, I don't necessarily have to have a bad condition to stimulate my selling skills? No, of course not. All you need to do is work really hard and learn new things every day. Cool. You know, my dream is to be an excellent seller and earn a lot of money. Well, I guess everybody often come here for the same reason. Otherwise, they wouldn't be here. Hopefully, I will be as good at selling as you are now. I totally believe this is possible. You can be better than this. I also have my own goals to get, you know? I haven't finished yet. Seriously, more you? But you have reached everything in life. I've learned a lot, that's true. But I want to be the best seller not only in the country but the world. I think you will get it soonly. And I hope to be a better seller when that moment comes to. Oh, I'm sure you will. I see you have very important qualities for being a seller. Seriously? You saying that? That's an honor for me. Thank you so much. Of course, I really mean it. You are a young, talented man. Just keep working hard. Honestly, I don't know what to say. I appreciate you took your time to help me. I'm here to help people, remember? And they rarely stay until this time. And you did. Well, it seems this time I thought things wisely. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's true. Well, I need to go now. They're about to close the conference room. Yeah, I think I should go now. Maybe I can invite you a cup of coffee as a thank. Oh no, that's not gonna be necessary. Don't worry. You don't need to do it. I want to do it thankfully. And also we can keep talking about selling while drinking a coffee. 
Well, if you insist, then let's go. I will get my briefcase and then we can leave. I hope you really liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more with this video, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. I'll see you in the next video. Oh, if you have any idea for a next video, just write it in the comments. Take care.